Hello and welcome back to Freel. Today we're going out with Chris from Lux Realty. Uh, as their sign suggests, they buy, rent and sell uh, property management. Uh, we're going to look at a house for sale, a place for rent and some land for sale also. So we're off to the first house, which is the one for sale. This is it here with the beautiful fence. Love decoration on the fence there. Have a nice place to put your um, tuk-tuk or motorbike or car. That is actually insulated, which is a, a really nice touch for um, Cambodia. Nice gate as you come through. It's got a uh, Cambodian slash Western theme to it. It's kind of open plan yet um, the, uh, done in a Western kind of style as well. It's kind of a re uh, really nice fusion. So in here you have the um, washing machine and all the stuff that goes with it. The tiling here is very neutral. You see in other um, units or houses uh, through Cambodia, the tile work is, uh, let's say, vibrant. So yeah, so it's nice uh, neutral uh, gray and white palette being used through this um, whole house. It's really nice. The house is actually 79,000 American dollars. Um, and that's negotiable. Really nice uh, side area there with banana trees there, tree bananas. So into the kitchen, it's a very open kitchen. So it goes that goes straight outside into the kind of main downstairs living area. Uh, the sink is stainless steel, very good. Um, also, you can fit a really large fridge um, and a pantry if you wish. So lots of room to um, store all your stuff. Quite high ceilings as well, nice and airy. Same tile work all the way through. And here's the, um, well, they call it the, probably the, the second bedroom. This is the bedroom downstairs. It uh, has an ensuite. They both have ensuites um, as well. Uh, the tile work is very well done. All new fittings and finishes. Uh, hot water system there for you. Tile work is very well done. As you can see down here on the floor, you don't see that very often. A new toilet, bum gun, and we come up here to the bench, and a new sink. Uh, also over here, there's a power point on the wall, and some good tile work. And then we'll zip up the stairs. There's still more of the downstairs. Up the stairs here. Um, this is what you um, pay your money for. It always has a nice breeze um, cam pot. And this is what the um, open plan concept of this house really gives you. So you can look out over there to Bacor Mountains over there, beautiful. And then this is the main bedroom. This main bedroom it has the air conditioner the top there large it's a very very large rooms they're quite big so there's your air conditioner and my biggest fan down there on the ground and this is probably the same as the other bathroom in their layout same tile work same tile work very nicely finished and hot water system, bum gun, and bench, and new sink. And this is the walk-in robe or wardrobe. You could probably change that into a office easily enough, so it makes it the main bedroom. So that's a nice little walk-in extra. This is outside on the balcony. Uh, always a nice breeze out here. You get that beautiful sea breeze. This is where why they have this open plan living so $79,000, um, Chris will, will talk you through all the things you need to do to purchase a property in Cambodia. Okay, this is the second property. This is the one for rent. It's just around the corner from the one that was for sale. Nice big open area. If you want to park your car or have a little barbecue. So you go around the back. And we've got where you put your washing machine, hang some washing. The washing machine doesn't come with the property, but you could probably negotiate that into the price. Water tank, just in case. 
Um, nice little side area, some trees for some privacy. Yeah, so we'll just go around to the front. This is the front, lovely wooden doors. Yeah, the lights turned on. Um, bit of mosaic tile work happening there. It's two bedroom, that's the first bedroom. And there's a second bedroom. This um, unit has, or well, house, this house has three um, bathrooms, um, two en suites and one in the kitchen area. They love their bathrooms in Cambodia. Two nice big windows. What's uh, letting a lot of light in. With um, most uh, places you move into, they will give you um, new sheets and pillowcases. So there's some uh, PowerPoints down there. There's also a place up there for your TV. There's a fan on the wall, and also a place you can put another air conditioner. So this is what I'm saying about the um, tile work in Cambodia. Uh, it's got a rainfall shower, which is very nice also. A nice new toilets and a sink. Uh, these are all wet rooms. Seems to be the um, norm in most houses in Cambodia. But you can see the tile work. <laughs> they love just not the normal tile. So this is the second bedroom. It's uh, around the same size. Just has got one big window instead of the um, two. Again, uh, new sheets and pillowcases. And this one here has the air conditioner already in it. I'll get that on the way back. Here's the same, taken to the same bathroom as mirror image of the one next door. Pop, uh, yep, the rainfall shower head, new toilet, new sink. There was an air conditioner in that one. This is the kitchen. We'll go back a bit here, see the lovely uh, doorway. Nicely done, there's another thing for a TV. You want two TVs. Um, in here, this is the kitchen slash dining room. You've got some security, just to keep everyone out. There's the back door that goes takes you out to where you can have the washing machine. And this is uh, the kitchen area. It has a lot of cupboards. Cupboards aren't um, usual, a usual um, thing in most Places you'll find, so this is a rarity to have cupboards. Quite a nice kitchen area, and here is a gone different uh, tile for this one. <laughs> it's a psychedelic tile, a still a rainfall shower head. Yet, um, Cambodians really do like their uh, different tiles. Uh, this one also comes with a fridge freezer, very uh, good to get a fridge freezer separate, very good. Okay, now this is the land. This land is huge. Um, talk to Chris about um, what you can do. The, the owner may um, subdivide uh, at the right price or do the whole um, block of land. This bit of land is on the water on Fisherman's Island. Uh, if you talk to Chris, he'll give you all the details where it is. It's a huge block of land um, worth talking about because um, you can get a beautiful block of land on the water. Absolutely amazing piece of land. Okay, so that's um, the little wrap up of the tour around Campot. I hope you like that. Uh, if you have any questions down below, um, I'll leave Chris's uh, email address and the website for Lux Realty. So um, as always, stay safe and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.